welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello i hope that you come and i hope that you stay for a while go ahead and click that subscribe button below and like this video if you're into purse tours if you've not read by the thumbnail i'm going to be doing a what's in my bag video now i know this is like old school but i wanted to revamp and just to do a 2022 what's in my purse i love purses i love designer purses so let me just jump right in so i have the louis vuitton stressa gm i love this bag it's so big i love every detailing about my bag and as you can see, it has a double strap. So with the double strap, I can really load this bag down. Like you wouldn't even believe. I love everything about my bag. Now I've had this bag for about two years now. And I just love that it's not something that everyone has. When I go out, I know that the Speedies are very popular and the uh, Neverfulls also very popular bag so when I got this I just completely fell in love I know that it looks I don't know if it's just because the video but it looks kind of wore out there's no cracking um, in the canvas or anything which I'm really proud of but I love monogram it's classic it's timeless and again I just I'm the kind of gal that I have to put everything in my purse so this is perfect, especially for travel, because my um, keep all is 60, and that's like, I guess, the biggest size that they have, and I can't carry that on the plane, so they want to put it under the plane, and I'm like, oh, absolutely not. No, I don't want to damage my bags that I paid a lot of money for. Actually, I got this bag from Belk. It's a company called What Goes Around Comes Around, and just out of the corner of my eye, I spotted all kinds of Louis, Gucci, different designers. And my heart was just like, I've got to have this bag. I've got to have this bag. So, anywho, um, I ended up getting this bag, which I really love. I know that everyone's not into designer bags, but I just love purses in general. And I love to keep them and collect them. And it's really an investment piece. So let me just go ahead and get straight into the bag video. So I'm just going to kind of show you the inside of my bag because they have this little organizer off of Amazon. I believe it was like 20, between 20 and 30 bucks for this. But this is a lifesaver, you guys. It makes sure that your bag is, stays basically clean. You know, there's no pen marks, trash, anything that could possibly get in damage your purse you no longer have to worry about that because there's inserts so even if you don't have a designer bag you can definitely buy those inserts because they're so amazing they've saved my bag you know my son sometimes he likes candies and treats and gum and stuff like that and and me with my pins so it doesn't get in my bag and ruin my bag but anyways i'm just gonna jump into my bag and just start pulling stuff out one by one so this is currently the bag that i'm using pads i know i'm like kind of crazy that i don't use tampons but i have endometriosis which causes um which is like a, a lining in my uterus that the walls expand that's how my um ob explained it to me causes me really bad painful periods i also don't get a period sometimes i went all the way up to six months without having a period so i don't use tampons at all i just love the pad even though i have to change the pad it's okay for me Next is my Sherpa wallet. Now I got this wallet from Target. I love this wallet. It's super handy. If I don't want to carry such a big bulky purse, I can carry this on my wrist, like a wristlet. So I get, it was like $20, maybe even less, 15, something like that. I have my makeup wipes. I never know when I'm going to have to use my makeup wipes. I used to be a hardcore Neutrogena fan and I still am but it's kind of pricey. So I found these at Target for only $2. And I was like, it's worth a try. So I got them and I fell in love with them. So now for the price that I paid for Neutrogena, and I know there are only 25 makeup wipes in there, but you never know. Sometimes there's makeup on my hands or 
that smears on my face for, you know, anything. And maybe I need to take off my lipstick or if I'm out to eat or whatever. So, I use these in the purple one. But they have different kinds. So, again, $2 cannot beat that. $2, you guys? Okay. <laughs> Next is my Sensodyne. Now, I do carry this whole thing. I know I could get, like, a mini travel size. But I haven't. I just, I like this one. <laughs> Next is my Brazilian um, crush. This is in the Sol de Janeiro. I got this from Sephora, which I really love. I also got the lotion. I just love the combination together. So it really just is everything that I need. Like if I just need a quick mist, I can just spray it and go. Every time I get this, people always comment on it. I love this. It's super affordable. I believe it's only like 20 something dollars. I'm not for sure. Maybe it is just $20, $22, something like that. But it smells oh so amazing. This is the pistachio and salted caramel. If you want to smell good, go get this. My aunt, she loves this. I'm more of a perfume girl. I have the um, Louis Vuitton perfume. They have several, um, but I'm not good with pronunciation. <laughs> so I can't tell you the name of it, but I can share a picture. But this is just as good, super lightweight, goes in my purse. If I need a quick touch up or if I smell, this is it. And then I have my deodorant. Now around this time of year, Native comes out with two kinds of deodorant. This is the peppermint deodorant. Um, it's just a stick. I love both the sprays and the stick deodorant, but I, I really, really love this one. Um, it's um, kind of pricey, but still love it anyways. Um, it's the candy cane. I don't know why I said peppermint. It's candy cane. But they also have a sugar cookie one that I love, and I have both. Then you never know when you're going to need a Band-Aid. So I have this mini Band-Aid kit because, again, you never know when you're going to need a Band-Aid. Stress gummies. Oh, these Ollie's have really saved my life. I love stress gummies because they just help me no matter what. If I'm stressed and I need immediate, like, calm, then these are it. These are the gummy kind. They also have it in a pill form. So, you know, if you like either one. These are also really good for travel. So, sometimes I get anxiety flying. Depends on how far um, and what time. <laughs> It depends on how the airport's been that day. I always have these. I carry these in all my purses, in my backpack. I have some by my bed. I have them everywhere. Then I have this room spray. This is White Barn. I got it at Bath and Body Works. Fiji White Sands. You guys, this is my all-time favorite spray. Fiji White Sands. That scent in general, I have it in a candle, I have it in everything, and I'm really disappointed because when I used to get my eyelashes done, I asked the girl, like, what is that smell? Because I smelled it every time I came in, the same scent, and she just ran through a list of them, and she was like, no, this is Fiji White Sands, and I was like, oh, I have to have it, I have to have it. So, if I run out of poopery, <laughs> or I just want the room to smell good or I'm kind of funny with smells but I always use this and just one pump is enough literally you'll choke yourself out if you spray this a lot then I have my anchor now this has been my best friend forever when I go to Disney, I always need a charger on hand. And the crazy thing about this charger is Anchor came out with another uh, portable charger, but you have to use your USB cord. This, you do not. So, on the side, as you can see, if I can get it up, they have connected is an iPhone charger. So, if you don't have iPhone, wouldn't recommend if you do get lucky enough to find one, comment down below and tell me because I want to get another one, but I can't find this one. 
So I just got really lucky to get this one. I love it. As you can see, if you just turn it on, there's four bars or little dots and they tell you and four is fully charged and then one is about to die. But I really love this anchor. I use it at Disney. It helps me. Um, and it, it really, I would say you can charge your phone, honestly, like two full times on zero by just having this charger. Now, I'm not sure about the other ones. Um, I don't know about the other anchors. I can't speak on something that I've never tried, but I'm sure it's just as good. This brand is like 10 out of 10. I would recommend if you find it. You're very lucky and and tag me below and let me know where you got it from because I need another one but as you can see the sun is starting to peel off but makes me kind of sad <laughs> but anyways I need another one but it still works just fine it literally works great speaking of poopery I actually have a mini poopery that I got now these little suckers are so expensive every time I go to Cracker Barrel they are outrageous, but this one was only $3.49, and it's normally like $5. This one I got from Tuesday morning. If you have a Tuesday morning near you, definitely go check it out because there's some hidden gems in um, Tuesday morning. Next is this Blossom Unscented Cuticle Oil. You guys, my skin around my nails always looks super bad, like... I had the most dry skin ever and I use this stuff and it's so easy. It's just cuticle oil. I'm sure if you go to the nail salon, they put it on your nails, but I'm in love with this one. This is a jumbo size that I got and I just keep it in my purse. Like if I need a little touch up, it really makes my nails look so healthy again versus being dry. Next, I have Bath and Body Works, again, Fiji White Sands. I have it in a hand sanitizer, which I love. This is my favorite scent. I'm going to be so sad when this goes out. But I don't know if it's like a seasonal thing with Bath & Body Works. I feel like when you get used to liking a scent, they just take it off the market. Like there was two um, body washes. They were aromatherapy that I got last year. I believe one was sea salt. It was like a dark blue. And then there was another one. And... I swear, if I knew that those two were going to go off the market, they were going to like take them away, I would have bought all of it, literally all of it. But anyways, I didn't know the names, but thankfully I take a picture of everything I get. So I was able to go back and find it. But I also carry Zyrtec around. My allergies get bad. When I'm around dogs or cats or really any animal, I just, my face starts acting up like I start sneezing I start coughing one day my eye was like a size of a golf ball it swelled so bad and I was able thankfully to get you know allergy medicine just keep it on me it's just so easy to just keep it on me then is my toothbrush I always like a travel toothbrush can never I mean if you've got toothpaste you've got to have your toothbrush right I have a mini floss. No, I like these flosses. I think I got this one from the dentist, but you can go in Target. It's like a dollar section. I don't know if Walmart has the dollar section. Maybe they do, but um, you can also get this regular floss. It's really good to floss your teeth. And then I have a pack of gum. I really just love this. It's a spearmint mint. Um, when, when you have gum, I just feel like if somebody knows that you have gum, like everybody asks for your gum. So it's always good to have some handy. I always try to keep, even if I have a pack open, I try to keep another pack in my bag that's not open, that's brand new. That way, you know, by the time someone asks for gum and another person asks for gum, my son, he loves gum. He digs in my bag and gets gum out if he knows that I have gum. So you always need some gum. You never know. I have a pen. I love colored pens. I love to, if I need to sign something normally, that's why I need a pen or someone else says I have a pen or I like to journal. I like to have an agenda. Sometimes I do have my agenda in my purse today. I don't have it in my purse, but sometimes I will carry that around because I'm kind of old school. I like to write stuff down um, because I just can't logically remember if I have something important or a doctor's appointment. 
I don't like to keep the cards. Like, I'm like in this declutter stage in my life. So, I don't like to keep just all kinds of um, cards. I don't know why, but I don't. Then I have my lip glosses. Now, this NYX Better Gloss, these are everything. They're so affordable. They're like $5. I get them in a pack at CVS. I don't know if Walgreens have them, but I know CVS has them. CVS has these in a kit. It has two and one has three. This is in shade Madeline. If you're looking for a brown nude, this is perfect for you. Um, you can also get these at Ulta really anywhere. I mean, NYX is really, really good. So, I've always loved them. They're super affordable. And then I have this Buxom Plumping Gloss. This is in White Russian. Now, this gloss is normally $21 or $22. And um, it, this is my favorite one. So, normally, this is my lipstick combination would be Charlotte Tilbury, Kim KW, and then I top it with the Buxom white Russian gloss, but I love Madeline. I also like fortune cookie and then creme brulee. I love, I love all three of those NYX. Like if I get a NYX gloss, it's probably one of those. Like I just, I love to stay. Um, and they're all so beautiful. I'm getting down to the last in my purse, but speaking of Kim KW, Charlotte Tilbury, I keep back stock in this because it's the perfect nude. When I first started trying this lipstick out, I just couldn't swing it. Like I just thought, oh, it's too light. But the combination of my lip liner, lipstick, and lip gloss is like the perfect nude. I can wear it with really any makeup look. And I just love the way it is. And sometimes they run out frequently at Sephora. So, but grab it while you can, girl. Advil. I always carry Advil on hand. I used to carry Tylenol, but I just feel like Tylenol doesn't do anything for me. And pretty much not taking your narcotic, I just take Advil. So, I love this. I have a full big size of Advil I got from Sam's Club. But I just love to refill this. Like there's nothing like a little compact Advil on the go. Of having my AirPods, I actually have three pair. Yeah, I have three pair. Um, I have two of the original ones and then I have these. I think these are the Pro. But I love that um, I get these. And my wife, she made me um, these AirPods custom made. I don't know if you can tell, but it says my wife, my life, which I like. It's so sweet. It's so thoughtful. So I just got to have these on hand. I normally carry all three on hand because if one dies, I can just use another one. But I will say wearing makeup all the time, they do get dirty. So I need to find a way to clean them without ruining them. But I just love these. I have this little case. I believe we got this from Etsy. She got this from Etsy for me, but it can also clip on your purse or keys. Normally, I have my phone and my keys in my wallet as well, but I take my keys out. And then my phone, today I'm having to film on my phone because I'm waiting for a new charger for my camera. I have the Canon G7X camera that I love to vlog with, but something happened. I got the camera a while back and then I didn't use it. So we're back on this trying to get it again. I don't know. I've looked everywhere in my house for it and it's literally driving me bonkers that I don't have it again right now. But that's a whole nother story. I've got a new one now, but this, I always carry an extra hair tie ladies. It's essential to carry a hair tie with you because you never know what you're going to need. You're going to need to put your hair up. I like to wear my hair down a lot. Um, no particular reason. I just like to wear my hair down. And lastly, if I get tired of lipsticks, then I will carry this around with me. This is the Watermelon Whimsical Watermelon Chapstick. I love chapstick. Pretty much my wife has gotten me turned on to a chapstick because I never wore chapstick. Only when my lips would crack 
mostly in the winter. Um, some mornings I would just wake up and my lips would hurt so bad. And then I would know my lips were bleeding that I needed some chapstick. So I always carry that with me, whether it be for me or whether it be for her. Because it's just something she can't, can't live without. But I love to carry chapstick with me and watermelon. I love the scent. I love the way it feels. And I got these from Buff City Soap. Um, if you don't have, um, a Buff City in your area, then I would definitely go to buffcity.com and order some. They're, they actually come in a pack of four and they're all scented fruit scents. So if you are into a fruity scent, then you will definitely love, but, um, that is all. I mean, this is pretty much wore out. I need to buy a new organizer, but this is my organizer and i lied guys because i see something else in my purse so i also carry another hair tie i love these hair ties they're not like regular hair ties these ones prevent my hair from breaking off or getting tangled up so i really love those and my favorite i probably put it in the bottom of like inside my real bag because i don't want to steal it so this is a walt disney resort pen i love Walt Disney. I'm hardcore Disney girl. I can literally live at Disney and if I lived in Florida I probably would have a season pass because I love Disney so much. But anyways, uh, this is my organizer. It has several pockets. It is wore out. I don't know if you can tell like it's pretty nasty but at least it's in this organizer which is only 20, 20, 30 bucks and I can just replace that. I don't have to worry about um you know, if it gets dirty or whatever, I can just change this out because $1,400 bag, $20 bag organizer. I mean, come on. So if it gets hair on it, if it gets pen stains in it, if it, something spills, I have it all in this organizer from Amazon. And yeah, that is all for what's in my bag. It does have some pockets, some deep pockets, to be honest, if you love that. Um, in your bag and then I ended up finding my little finger things for when I go tan I'm, I look like crazy girl but I have 10 of these and I put all the rest of them are in my car but I put all of these on my fingers um, when I go to tan to spray tan I spray tan very often and I just want to protect my nails especially if I get them done um but yeah, that is all for what's in my bag. I hope that you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. And I am going to be vlogging every day for the rest of this month. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video. Much love. I love you guys. And thank you for being here. And have a great Wednesday.